School Stories, part one. So this was in second grade. Well, I was in second grade, and my bestie was in first grade, and yeah. So basically, we were just talking, minding our own business, and then this guy, we don't know who he is. The only thing we know is that he's from our school, from the school we go to, because he has the uniform. So he was just staring at us, like... And we were just staring at him, and he was staring at us. So I uh, asked him, um, "Are you okay? Do you want like some candy? You know they don't allow, you know they don't allow candy here, yeah? You know? Like, um, like something wrong? Like, uh, why are you here? Like, hello, hello?" And then all of a sudden, he just does. <laughs> he throws up. <laughs> so this guy, this little man, this one, this one, this one right here, almost vomited on my best friend. And then, and then he just, and then he just waddled, he just uh, waddled uh, away. He just walked away. But then he came back and continued staring at us again. And we didn't talk to him this time. And still... He did. Well, I well, I when I blinked, he just did, <laughs> and then he just walked away. And then he just stared at us again. It was like a loop. So we just waited until recess was over. Anyway, there, so uh, let me tell you about the girl in this story, Belen. She's toxic, a copycat, because when I first came to the school and I told, uh, and I told the class my fairy color, that was blue, what basically happened is that she said, oh, mine is too. But her friends told me that her favorite color was pink. And she always copies my hairstyle. Well, sometimes she tries to copy my hairstyle because I'm, because I do amazing hairstyles, y'all. So, so she has friends and because she's toxic, her friends don't like her. She, they hate her. So they made a group of of peop for people who hate Belen. And this is me. Yes, I'm in the group of hate Belen. She's also a so she's also a pick me. She's selfish, but not the pick me who is like, like I'm one of the bull, like uh, like the one that's ill. Girls are so toxic. Like she's the the type of the other type who's like I'm so small. I wonder what the gun is. It's like a combination, actually. It's like if you put uh, like two pick me girls together. She's also selfish because 
She doesn't trust her friends and many more things. She she's suspicious. She's suspicious of people who she doesn't know. She's she's also very mean and a drama queen. She's also grumpy, jealous. You know. So, let me tell you about the story. So, we were doing math. Imagine this is the whiteboard. So, the teacher was putting the answers because our time was up. So, it was like um, 30 plus. So, basically... If you're wondering what happens if you get one wrong, like this one, I don't know. You you don't just do get your eraser and no, you can't do that. You have to put an X, then do that, and change it to the right answer. Wait. And then change it to the right answer. And then you do teak. Yes, we call it a teak. So basically, so we were just doing the math, you know. 2 plus 2 equals 4. But then we got into the hard part. You know, the hard part. Like multiplication and stuff. I hate multiplication. Like the thirteen x thirty. No, thirty. I don't know. Imagine this. So, so she gets very angry and sad and drama filled when she gets one wrong. Happy face. I uh, I'm not sure what it, what how well it is. And 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 she noticed that she got too wrong. She always got like if she gets like one wrong, she gets angry and goes to the bathroom. But too wrong. Oh, she just burst out. She just so like I was just studying and I was just check and I was just seeing if I got I got three wrong by the way. And I was like, oh man. But then I heard <gasps> and I saw Belen crying her peach off. Because she got two wrong. Two. She just burst out. She was like, <gasps> My mom is gonna grow me so bad. My dad is gonna be so disappointing. Disappointed. My brother is gonna be so. And my brother's gonna think I'm an idiot, but I'm not. So well I I was just looking at her just crying and her teacher and the teacher coming over and seeing what was wrong she thought he thought she stubbed her toe or something and when I was looking at her I was like you little <clears throat> you got two wrong. I got like one. No, I got three wrong. Well, anyway. I was just annoyed. Like, she's a big. I just thought, girl, you're a pick me girl. You're just trying to get everyone's attention. Just two wrong will get you to college. I think. I think. 
Anyways, that's um, the two stories, the two school stories that I'm going to tell you guys today. So, yeah. Oh, and now I figured out that his name, the Vomit Kid. Yeah, we called him the Vomit Kid before we learned his name. His name was Tommy. But we still called him, uh, but because we know, now he know, we know his name, now we call him to- Throw Up Tommy, because he almost, because he threw it up. So, uh, yeah, yeah, and yeah, 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 so yeah, uh, do you like her? So, yeah, um. Yeah. So uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm sorry if it's kind of cringy. But yeah. uh, Goodbye then.